Hey, beautiful. How you doing? I'm good. Listen, Gigi, I didn't really call the chat. I have some news for you. Okay, shoot. I... I... God, why is this so hard to tell you? Baby, it's okay if it's hard. I can wait forever till you say hello. I know, baby. I know. It's just... Alright. I'm just gonna say it. There's not really an easy way. Alright, honey, what's wrong? Now you got me a bit worried. Casey, I'm pregnant. Oh, baby. <laughs> that's... that's fantastic news. Did you go to the doctor yet? Is, is it all finalized? Yeah. Wow. I mean... <laughs> that's good. Oh, God. That's great. Here, I was hoping, you know, that last weekend we spent together would last forever. Damn. There's more I have to tell you. Maybe after hearing news like that, you can keep telling me as much as you want. <laughs> I mean, I know it's going to be a good life for us. I know, you know, it's a bit early for us to have a kid and all, and don't even have a ring. But I mean, I can go out and get one and, you know, go work with Don't worry. Wait, why? What, what? But what about that weekend we had together? <laughs> what happened to all that? Yeah, it's it's not yours. It belongs to Justin. Who's Justin? He's my ex-boyfriend I had before you. He didn't leave. You did. The kid is his. It's not yours. And, and Casey? Yes? Neither am I. Wait. Heather? Huh? Hello? Hello? supposed to do? Not high enough.
this will work. You really gotta try this, aren't you? Don't try to talk me out of this. Alright, I won't try to talk you out of making a mistake. Mistake? Have you seen what my life has become? My life is terrible! Terrible? Terrible? How so? My girlfriend of three years just left me because of my choice to be here. And how did she do that? She hooked up with some other guy and stole all my dreams away from me. I promised her a ring. I promised her, you know, she knew we, I wanted to get married. But no, no. She just ends up going out and getting pregnant from some other dude. A guy named Justin? Oh, God. I know who he is. Who? Who is he? The slush show guy. Four dudes. <laughs> she traded a safe and secure future for the slush show dude. What can I say, dude? She was a harlot. Shut up! She wasn't a harlot. Casey, listen to me. She's hooked up with another guy, got pregnant, and then broke up with you. She was a harlot. Only a high school dropout like her would choose a slush guy over someone in your position. Exactly. Exactly, right? I mean... I... I, I just... I, I, I don't need this kind of stress. I don't. It's not like I don't have enough stress to begin with. What kind of stress would lead you to break like this? I've got school, I've got tests, I've got instructors bearing down on me like white on rice being eaten by a polar bear in a snowstorm. And I... I'm done. I can't, I can't do this anymore. I just can't. This is it for me. Ending it isn't the answer. Yes it is. It's the answer to all my problems. Well, Mr. Man with all the answers, how are you gonna do it? I'll just take this knife right here. And... <laughs> Just right across my throat, right across the jugular, and everything will just go right down the drain. What about the emotional toll this will take on your friends and your family? Did you ever think about them? They don't need me or my mess. <laughs> they can just toss my body in a river for all I care. I, I don't need this right now. I, I can't. I'm not gonna let you do this. You don't have a choice. I'm doing this whether you like it or not. There are things in your life that are worth more promise, that are more fulfilling than anything you could be do thinking of doing right here, right now. You don't know that. You don't know anything. You don't know anything about me. Really? Really? I know more than you think. I know you're in pain because you don't know how to handle losing your first girlfriend. I know that your intelligence is being blocked by your emotions. I know that you're also looking for the easy way out. How could you possibly know that? You're me! On the other side of me, Casey. On the side of you that sees that there's more to it than this. And all of that starts putting down that knife. So what, you're supposed to be the, the good side of me? Well, I bet you love just how wrong you are right now. I'm wrong? Yeah, because I bet you never saw this coming. No! You can't stop me now. Yes, I can. I'm sorry. Well, you did the right thing. You're a hero. I'm a hero? Yes. Anytime someone prevents themselves or anyone else for that matter from committing suicide, they're a hero. You're a hero. 
Thank you. Hey Matt, I'm gonna go get some food. You wanna come? Yeah. What's that? Alright. Man, what do you want? Anything's good with me. Really? Alright, four dudes we go. No. No, 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 no. Come on, don't worry, I'll follow you. Hi, this is Casey Williamson from The Other Side. If you're considering suicide or know someone else who is, then talk to someone. Be a hero. Call the Suicide Prevention Line at 1-800-SUICIDE. Talk to someone. Be a hero.